The South Korean government will assemble a special team to carry out a thorough review of Nuri. The findings are expected to reveal what led to the rocket failing to put its satellite payload into the orbit despite completing all three stages. Kim ji has the details. South Korea's own homegrown space rocket duty, which took off on Thursday, completed all of its flight sequence as scheduled, but failed to put its 1.5-ton dummy payload satellite into orbit as its engine shut off 46 seconds earlier than expected. An investigative team will be put together within the next two to three weeks to find out what led to the early shutdown, even after duty finished its three-stage separation flight sequence. Meanwhile, local media outlets cited experts not directly involved with the launch who speculate that there may have been a problem with the automatic launch sequence system that detects a problem in a high-pressure tank or some of its 100 sensors that monitor the rocket's valves. There are dozens of valves and a process to collect data on whether they opened or closed properly and at the right time will be carried out depending on the varying pressure points. So the pressure to push the rocket further may have led to the early shutdown. They'll compare the sensors on their simulations to see if there have been any defects in one of the valves. Thursday's launch marks the first step for South Korea's space program in meeting its target of landing a first domestically developed probe on the moon by 2030. To increase reliability, the country will be conducting four more launches of duty until 2027, with the earliest planned for May next year. Kim Jian, Arirang News.